I want the Botox injections. Welcome back to another vlog as you guys can see I decided to straighten my hair again and I literally love it so far y'all I'm also getting better with the little curling iron but you guys did see my um whole get getting ready process from like washing to the styling let me put this down I'm not but yeah I gave y'all a little montage of me getting my hair done well me doing my own hair um and I really do love how it looks y'all like it has a nice shine the whole process did take me a long time maybe like four hours but then again maybe that's not too long but the results are cute look at all that body y'all today is Friday and I started a vlog on a Friday like I never do that but I wanted to document this process for y'all for the vlog so I was like let me just go ahead and start it now also y'all today is um a memorial day well not memorial day weekend but it's the day of the memorial so in my religion we go and celebrate the death of jesus um today it's also easter weekend so just so people who aren't in my religion will know like what i'm talking about it's the same weekend as easter so i'm basically getting myself ready for that i decided to do my hair flat iron it and then i'm gonna pick out an outfit and everything it's actually five um 5 35 right now it starts at 7 30 so i gotta do my makeup and get also gotta pick an outfit because i don't know what i'm gonna wear but that's what i'm about to do right now i'm gonna go ahead and start my makeup because it's gonna take like an hour oh my god i gotta start right now because we gotta leave here at like 6 45 i'm behind like y'all i'm behind and i literally have been doing my hair this whole day feel like and i'm behind like what's going on what is going on okay but if you are new to your girl's channel go ahead and subscribe we would love to have you over here and yeah i will come back once i am finished getting ready and let you guys see the whole look so y'all here's my look oh my gosh i'm in love with how my makeup turned out and with the hair and the fit is this dress. It's super cute. Let me see if I can turn it down. Okay. Here's the dress. It's giving. Okay. So, yeah. I'm going to see you guys later. I'm in a rush. So, good morning, guys. It's the next morning. And... Uh, I hope everyone had a great memorial if you did go. Um, I'm about to take my hair down. Y'all, my hair, oh my gosh, it did not last, girl. Like, I did my hair yesterday, and then yesterday it was like humid outside, so humid. So it ended up like frizzing up, so I just put it in like a ponytail. It still looks decent. It still looks decent, but I don't like this frizz. Like, I just did my hair. Why is it already frizzing? But, y'all, I came home and I, like, washed my face. No, I lied. I did not wash my face. I took my makeup off and I still have, like, some... I still have, like, mascara under my eyes. I didn't even wash my face. But that's how you know you had a good time is... If you literally got home and was like, I'm just going straight to bed. I'm doing the bare minimum. So I need to wash my face and everything. But today is Saturday. 
and I have so much stuff to edit, so much work to get done. Also, I, I want to record for you guys my morning skincare video. I think I'm going to record that in a separate video and then post that before this vlog goes up and then I'm gonna put my nighttime skincare video in this vlog. This new product that I got from Tatcha, just randomly, um, while I work with them. But the Tatcha Clarifying Clay Mask, y'all, oh my gosh. It's a new mask and sis. Oh, it smells good. This is bomb. Like, wow. So it's a um like an exfoliating type of mask and also a pore clearing a pore cleansing mask. So over time it helps to reduce like the appearance of pores. Um and I actually feel like my skin was like flawless after I used it. And it's like a warming sensation when you put it on as well. It most definitely was a hit to me. So I'm going to be using that again for sure. But right now I'm about to edit a vlog. It's Y'all, this vlog is supposed to go up tomorrow and I have yet to even start editing it yet. So I'm going to try to hurry up and do that today. And I got to do some of my hair because there's no way that day two hair is looking like this. Like I feel disrespected. I feel very disrespected all the time I spent doing my hair yesterday and for it to be frizzy. I think it's also probably because I use, y'all see all that? I use bio silk. And I just don't, I used to, my hair used to really, when I had a relaxer, my hair liked bio silk. But now, bio silk does not do anything for my hair. I feel like the oil sits on top of my hair versus it actually like penetrating my strands. And when I remember when I used these in my video, my actual straightening video. This, I felt like, got my hair way more sleek than the Bio Silk. I, I use Bio Silk in Design Essentials. And y'all, I just don't feel like my straight, my flat iron was sleek enough or as sleek as it was before. Like, I need an anti frizz. That's what I need anti frizz something. But a black people anti frizz, not a anti frizz. Because they had on be frizzing like I had be frizzing. I need something for our hair, okay? Hey girl, so it's a little bit later on in the day and we're about to head on out to a um, gender reveal that we have to go to today. Oh girl, now my, my bra pad is popping out this shirt. I gotta get that together, hold on. Okay. I'm trying to show y'all the fit. Hopefully y'all can see it, ignore the mess around me, but this is what I'm wearing, these pants from Zara. This right here is from j -Lux Label, I believe. And then for my shoes, either my white or brown sandals. It's pretty cute. And then for the scent, I think I'm going to mix Bubble Bath with Versace Dylan Blue. Yeah. Mm, it's giving spring. And for my hair, y'all, I put the silk curler in it. So I let it sit for like three hours. And this is what the results look like. So, yeah. So we're on our way. And uh, this is a gender reveal of one of our friends. So like we hang out with like a lot of people out here in Austin a good bit, but I just never like show it on the vlog because like I never actually pick up the camera. It's just like always in the moment interactions. But it's one of our um, friends. There are a couple out here, and they are having a, their first baby. So it's so exciting. Um, so we're gonna see what the gender of the baby is today. And I don't know if I'm gonna vlog it, probably not. I'll probably just like let you guys know like what the gender is because like, I just don't like being in like people's space, you know, and it's like a special moment. So I'll see what the vibe is and if I vlog it, I vlog it. If I don't, I highly doubt you guys even care. <laughs> But this weekend, the weekend I decided to straighten my hair, it's like super humid and like it keeps on frizzing up. Like, look at my hair, y'all. Look at my hair. Like, it doesn't look bad, but it's also not, you know, how I know it could look. So. Baby, 
Hey sis, so I am back from the gender reveal and it's a boy. I am like, I feel like every single gender reveal I've been to, it's always been a girl. So the fact that it was a boy, I'm just like so excited for them. And they are also very excited as well. Like they could not believe that it was a boy. So happy for them. I love whenever, you know, true love continues and now they're bringing in another baby to love it is just a beautiful sight to see okay so congrats to them um but right now i am back at home and it's 9 40. i feel so good y'all i took my shower i did my skincare but y'all i'm so comfy i have on this white fox boutique set it is just the cutest and most comfy set ever. And it's also fitting a little tighter in the leg. So y'all already know what that means. Girl, getting a little thick down there, okay? I've also been using the K-Skin lip product with the SPF by Win Winnie Harlow. And I really do like it. This is what it looks like on my lips. It reminds me of the Summer Fridays gloss that I, well, balm that I recommend to you guys, but it has SPF in it. So it's like even better. I'm probably going to see you guys in the morning or tomorrow. And I believe I'm going to be doing my nighttime skincare routine for you guys tomorrow. So see y'all in the morning, babes. Y'all, good morning. It is Monday. I don't think I vlogged uh, yesterday. I don't think I vlogged anything. Yesterday I was, was just like a reset day for me. I like cleaned up the whole house. I did the laundry. I cleaned up this room got this together but today is monday and it's a new day my training session got moved to 12 so that's good it gave me time in the morning to get stuff done and my um hair i decided to wrap it last night because oh my gosh <laughs> i decided to wrap it last night because it was just getting, it's just getting so frizzy, y'all, because of this weather out here. Like, I'm literally so upset. I watched so many videos on YouTube yesterday on, like, how to fix frizzy hair. Because it's still frizzy. Like, even though I washed it, I mean, even though I wrapped it, it's still getting frizzy. And I just, I'm, I'm literally upset, honestly. But I did want to show you guys um, everything that I got last week as far as shopping. Um, when they was in town also y'all i decided that um i'm going to be doing weekly giveaways on instagram um because i have so much stuff that i need to give away and this good quality high product like high price products that i just either have doubles of or I'm not, i know i'm not going to use so i wanted to show like try to figure out a way of how can i you know get rid of these things but in a good way so the way it works is each week a new winner is picked based off of who engages with my content so that's going to be comments on my videos whoever engages with my content so i can actually like pick and see who's engaging um one winner each week will get a box from me i actually already have two let me grab it like i already have two huge boxes that are not designated to anyone so these are going to go into the giveaway those are going to be two of the giveaway boxes for the first two weeks probably so we did go to sephora as y'all saw so i'm gonna show you guys what i picked up um so i actually re-upped on my dermalogica vitamin c line this is so expensive y'all this vitamin c is not cheap it's literally like 87 dollars for this little small one and then this is like 60 something dollars but when i tell y'all Vitamin C, if you have a good or high quality vitamin C, it's not going to be cheap, okay? The one by The Ordinary, it's like seven bucks. It's still a really good one, but it's not like, this is really, really high quality vitamin C. And I really did enjoy that. Then I did exchange the one size color, but this one is still not my skin tone. It's like, this one's too red, I I think it still doesn't work for me so I have to go I'm just let them match me this time because clearly I can't do it myself I also got the you to the people Yerba mate resurfacing energy facial I wanted to try one of their different um, face masks because I already love the gray one so I'm excited to try this one out then I got the Olaplex number no. nine bond protector this is their new product so they just came out with this try that out 
And then I got, I did pick up two of the Seate London Watermelon um, Burst Hydrating Oils. This is what I used on top of my lips to get that shine on all my lip looks. But this I ordered online. It, it's not in the store in my location. But this is what it looks like. And y'all, it's literally amazing. Honestly, you can use the dollar one from the, beauty, from the corner store, the beauty supply store, girl. That one's like 15 bucks, but I just repurchased it because I like it a lot. Then I got the one that we were showing you guys. This Elasti, um, it's the new one by Sol de Janeiro. I got a mini because I was like, it smells really good, but I want to just test it out before I buy the large one. Then I got a dupe, another one of my Peace Out Skincare Patches. Baby, let me tell y'all something about these. You can put this on your face, on your yaya yeah, yeah area if you have an ingrown girl this thing works okay it sucks out the pus from like the bumps on the face and stuff and girl the bump goes down okay like if you don't want to pop your bumps which you should not do these are amazing okay then y'all i decided to get the giorgio armani aqua de G aqua di gio 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 girl i don't know the Day perfume i decided to get this one this is a amazing spring fragrance okay i feel like this is the spring fragrance that everyone is going to like it's like i feel like you can't you can't not like that one if you're looking for like a spring sweeter floral type of fragrance this is going to be it okay so i just decided to pick that up when i first went into the store it was this one or bubble bath and i picked bubble bath then the second time i went i just decided to get that one as well then i got this nars um lippy in the color Le Freak. I ordered this online, but I already used it, so it's not in there. <laughs> then I decided to get the Faded. I ordered this online as well. The Faded Topicals Brightening and Clearing Mist. This is the one that I heard so much about as well, so I was like, let me try it. I am using the cream right now, the serum, um, on my bottom area. And it's actually, I feel like it's kind of good. And then I got the Supergoop Glow Oil. Oh, I'm so excited to try this. We have like a bow party coming up and I'm going to put this all on my body, girl. And I'm going to be glowy and SPF 50 protected. Okay. Um, then I got the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Cheat Intense. This is a liner that everyone was talking about. So I said, let me try it. And that's it. Um, and then I also got some, oh, I got some stuff from Aloe Yoga and... Where else do we shop? Zara. But I pretty much showed you guys already seen all the Zara stuff. But I'm about to get my breakfast and then record my morning skincare routine video. Oh, I'm so mad at my hair. What was that? Also, thank you guys for 100K on my hyperpigmentation video. Ladies, I just now finished filming my entire skincare routine video. I cannot wait to post this because I know you guys are really going to enjoy it. And I also thank you. I think I told you guys we hit 100K on my skincare routine video. So I'm like, wow, that's amazing. Okay, my glass skincare routine video. The quality came out good. So you guys will be able to see what it looks like. I also am in love with the skin the skincare shells that we installed. Well, that Nick installed. Really, really, really convenient. Really, really good for the bathroom. And it's a great way to save that space, baby. Okay. So now, y'all, it's actually 11 o'clock. So I still have a whole hour before my um, gym, my training session, basically. So I think I'm going to, I need to actually eat something because I ate breakfast, but I didn't finish it. So I need to put something else in my body and then head on to the gym. If you guys have ever wondered what these dark spots are on my neck, I have eczema. I'm not sure if I ever shared that with you guys, but I have eczema here and I also have eczema in between the crease of my arm. You guys see how it's darker right there and it's on both arms. So it's something that was in I inherited from my mother. <laughs> But I um, use this cream on my neck, but I have not been using it for so long. But I'm kind of getting back into the routine of using it, and it literally helps to like lighten up these eczema spots. But I'm pretty sure you guys have, have like wondered that because it's literally in every single video, and y'all are probably like, "Why is her neck so dark?" It's because I have eczema. Okay, my neck ain't dirty. <laughs> I wash my neck every night. <laughs> it's just 
it's just eczema flares basically so what can you do i just came back from the gym y'all and i had an amazing workout but it's so funny because i like I felt like I was dragging through the workout today, but we actually ended earlier and I did everything in the right amount of time. But at my door was this Amazon gift card. Someone in my congregation or my hall, I gave her a whole like little package of products, of like skincare products. And um, she sent me an Amazon gift card and I was like, oh my God, that was so sweet. I was not expecting this at all. It says, Crystal, thank you so much for the skincare goodies. I couldn't thank you enough. I love them all. You are such a glamorous and beautiful girl from the inside out. <laughs> thank you. Girl, we about to go on Amazon. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. I was not expecting this at all because I was literally just giving them to her. I was not expecting anything in return, but... <laughs> We will never deny Amazon gift cards over here, okay? So thank you so much. You know who you are. Um, and then, y'all, after my workout, I went to Diptyque because my nar... Okay, I've been saying narugali, but it's apparently nargule. But I've been saying narugali. Hold on. It's this one right here. I say narugali, but when I went in there, he was like nar nargule or something like that, he said. I really don't care, but <laughs> I got some new candles because I'm literally like, look how low this one is. And I love, love, love this scent. So I got the Corian, cor Coriander, Coriander, girl. I hate pronouncing these because like, why is it so hard to pronounce these? And why are they like the whole wording of these are so complicated because it's like what order am I reading in left to right right to left up to down girl what's going on so I got that one because it smelled really really good and then I got a re-up of this one but anyway I'm about to go drink my smoothie eat some food and then I'm checking with y'all a little bit later baby so y'all ain't gonna believe where I'm going okay let me just run down the story of how we got here so i was in my office reading my emails i was getting a little hungry but i read a certain email that passed <laughs> that came in my inbox and it said hey when are we going to be getting your content for this campaign y'all i have content that was due today i completely forgot about it and instead of me editing the content and submitting it to the brand i decided I'm going to get crawfish because <laughs> I'm not going to let anything stress me out. Like you cannot possibly stress me out. Her, because what you thought. <laughs> yeah, it just looks so good. Like there's never a time in life when I would not want crawfish. Never. That was too good. Bring me the bill. <laughs> I'm going to keep on saying that after every time I eat something that was too good. But I've decided after I've eaten my food that I no longer need to go to the grocery store today. I got Nick some food and I already have some sandwiches at home anyway. So if I do get hungry later on, I can just eat that. But instead, I'm going to be responsible and I'm going to go home and edit this content for that brand. Get that out to them. Oh, oh, girl. Y'all hear that? Somebody in probably got into an accident. I hope everybody is okay. It's a lot of, it's a lot of ambulances. Ambulances. Is that the right way to say that? Am ambulances? Ambulances? Because y'all know how black people be pronouncing things wrong. They be saying, see, it was the wrong way. It's ambulance. I said, wait, I said ab ambulances? Isn't it ambulance? Wait, that's not the same thing. Ambulance? Oh, I, I think they be saying am uh, ambulances. That's the, that's the ambulance. And it's ambulance. Oh girl, who cares? Alone. Every night alone. Why am I alone when I know that you want me to? Am I wrong? Tell me that I'm wrong. Tell me I deserve all the pain that you put me through. You don't never bring me good news, babe. Ow! You don't never bring me good news, babe. Yo, that grocery store is packed. Yeah, that makes sense because yesterday was Easter and they were closed. Whoo! I'm happy I ain't going there today because I would have been in that grocery store for like 
a whole hour and a half. I can already feel it. Okay. See, everything happened for a reason. Hey, girl. Hey. So, it's later on in the evening. And I actually, y'all, edited and submitted my content. So, okay. Um, I just now got out of the shower and I'm feeling so good, all lotioned up and everything. So I wanted to show you guys my nighttime skincare routine. Today I'm just going to use my You To The People um, Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamin Superfood Cleanser. I mean, are we shocked? Are we shocked? I think not. Look at how good this sets up. My favorite, y'all. Just listen to this. washing the full day away and i only use paper towels to dry off my skin i love this over towels highly highly recommend to use paper towel over a regular towel and it also helps to prevent breakouts all right now i'm going to go in and tone and i'm going to be using the polish choice exfoliant oh my gosh y'all are we surprised well y'all probably are but let me just tell you guys something this exfoliant, I forgot to mention my exfoliant in my skincare video, the first one I made, and y'all were asking me, do I, like, I mean, do I tone? And I do. I love, love, love this toner. Now, I only use this toner when I am not exfoliating my skin already in like the washing process or using any other exfoliating products on my skin. So if you do wanna see which toner I use if I am, using exfoliating products then i did include that in my other those skincare video that i just now posted this one just makes me look like very hydrated it gives me a glow and this is like one of the only toners that actually give me a glow once it's dried down and it also helps to lighten up dark spots as well and to unclog pores so highly recommend this one does take a little bit longer to actually soak into the skin so while that's soaking in i'm going to steam my face tonight ah so excited and i'm going to be using my regular degular steamer y'all like my amazon one nothing new here nothing fancy or anything okay i put on this headband because i don't want my edges to revert <laughs> I look ridiculous. Okay, I just put on a bonnet. And I like to apply a serum to my face whenever I steam so that the serum could like really absorb into my skin. So I'm going to be applying the Plum Plump by Glow Recipe and the Niacinamide Dew Drops. So I'm doubling up on the moisture today. If you want to feel like you're at a spa, you need to get a steamer, baby, okay? This whole time I brought this light in here to use and I hadn't been using it. Oh, you could just feel how much more absorbed the product is in your skin once you steam. So if you do have a hard time with like your skin absorbing products, I highly recommend steaming because it opens up your pores to make room for those products to really seep in. All right, now let's continue with the skincare. The next product I'm going to be using is my retinol. So I already used my vitamin C's earlier in the day. Um, typically, I would apply the ascorbic acid right now in my routine if I were to use it again tonight. When I was really trying to heavily clear up my dark spots, I was using this twice a day, so morning and nighttime, and I would apply it in, in the problem areas and let it sit for like 10, 15 minutes and then apply my next product. But I'm just going to go right into my retinol for tonight. And this is the Ordinary Grand Active Retinol 10% Emulsion. This stuff is amazing, y'all. It really, really is. To me, it provided me with like a more even skin tone the more I used it and smoother skin. And retinol is also really good for like preventing aging. So I, I feel like it's better to get ahead of it. <laughs> And let it smack you in the face later on in life so it's also good for that 
Now, whenever I apply a retinol to my skin, I like to keep it very, very basic with my moisturizer. So I'm gonna be using the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. And, and I literally should have purchased another one of these at the Sephora sale because I'm like, I'm like almost out. Okay, now y'all, <laughs> this next product, like, this is one that I've been applying to my skin as of lately because I got this in PR and I was like, oh my God, I was so intrigued by it. And I've been using it and oh my gosh, I feel like my skin looks so much smoother when I wake up in the morning. And that's the Kiehl, I mean, not Kiehl, Sunday Riley Luna Sleeping Night Oil. This is a, it says retinol and blue tansy. So I am kind of like pushing it by already using the retinol, oh wait. It says that I should not use this with other retinol, so maybe I should not put this on my face tonight. But y'all, I'm gonna use it tomorrow. But this is so good. Like, oh my gosh, I am new to Sunday Riley, and like their stuff is good. And it's actually blue, like, it's blue. Now the very last product that I use on my face is my lip balm. Oh. Uh, to get up to grab it. The one that I have been obsessed with for my nighttime lip balms is the Agave Plus by Bite Beauty. I use thicker lip balms at night because I want my lips to be really, really soft when I wake up. And the very last thing that I'm putting on my skin, like I was telling y'all, I do have eczema, so whenever I go to sleep, I like to layer on my cream on my neck. It really does honestly make me feel like um, embarrassed or just not embarrassed, but it affects my confidence at times because I'm like, man, why is why does my neck have to be like, why do I have to have eczema on my neck? Like that's kind of frustrating and it does get to me, but I'm just like, what can I do about it? Like I just have to keep on applying this cream. I'm just being honest, I'm human and you know, I like certain things bother me, but in other news, it's like, Kim, there are people dying. <laughs> but this is what my skin looks like, y'all. It is so hydrated. And I had a comment on my skincare video, by the way, where someone was like, wet skin is a goal. I don't see how walking around with wet skin could be a goal. For one, honey, my skin ain't wet. It's glowy. Don't get mad because you're be flaking all day, okay? It ain't wet. And I would much rather have moisturized, glowy skin than dry skin. Like, y'all, my skin is not wet. Once this like soaks into my face, it's going to be dry by the morning and even before the morning time. But I naturally just have an oilier skin, okay? It's not something I can do about. Like, I can't fix that, y'all. So keep those comments to yourself. Oh, y'all, I almost forgot to tell y'all my scent of the night is Bubble Bath by Replica. Oh, the perfect going to bed sense girl the perfect everyday everything sent honestly mm. she is trying to kill me what is this? What is this, ma'am? It's good for you. <laughs> Excuse me? I am one body, one woman. Because my trainer does not like me. She has me doing this stuff. And like, just like this, right? Yeah, shoulder. My mama calls, see you on TV. Sunset shit done trains ever since we was on our dream. How you feeling? Zero out of ten. Do not recommend. <laughs> so this is what I was able to come up with in the time that I had. I did a little something, something to my hair. I think it's kind of cute. For my scent, I'm gonna be wearing the Giorgio Armani one that I got recently. It's really, really good for like a daytime scent. Oh, it smells so fresh. I really do like that. Okay. And shoes, maybe I'll just wear my 
my airman slides like I always go to. that was really really fun to hang out and talk business stuff um kind of just like discuss certain and stuff with like instagram youtube tiktok so um that was really nice but y'all why did i waste the chicken all on the chicken sauce all on my shirt girl but okay so i'm gonna go to trader joe's y'all for the first time ever i've never been to trader joe's is it focused on me okay i've never been to trader joe's and i want to get some eucalyptus um if you guys have been following me for a while then you know that i used to have the eucalyptus in my shower for my videos all the time but once i moved and then like it got old i just stopped having it and i used to have the subscription but i was like uh I'm just wasting money so i stopped having it but i really want it in my shower again Aaliyah's face i got hers from there so i'm like hmm but i do want to go back to trader joe's after this to just like see what um what the hype is about baby because when i tell you the girls are on trader joe's the hype must be real okay so let me know in the comments what y'all be getting from trader joe's because i promise you i'm gonna go back and actually shop y'all also guess what girl i measured myself today why my waist is down one and a half inches girl i used to be a 31 inch in the waist i know i know don't talk about it we ain't gonna talk about it and girl when i measured myself this morning Okay, ma'am, watch it. It said 29.5. I was like, girl, don't talk to me. Coke bottle, where you at? <laughs> Sprite bottle, where you at? Okay? Coke bottle figure. Yes, ma'am. Okay, girl, we're here. As soon as I walk in, look what I see. Eucalyptus, $3.99. Oh my God, that is so cheap. <gasps> girl hold on let me find out they the plug okay this one i need this one i like this one it looks kind of small hold on maybe that's why it's 3.99 <laughs> i think i'm only need like two of them though maybe i'll just get two because i usually have this time i'm gonna get this one look a little light yeah that would look a little, a little skimp so i'm gonna get these two Oh, they smell so good. Oh my gosh. <gasps> as soon as I walk in. Okay, I can see how y'all like this. It's like a little community up in here. Hey, okay. Okay, go ahead, do your little thing. No, I give a eucalyptus right here, you know. We're oh. Gonna, we're gonna wrap it around the shower leaves, you know. <laughs> lay, lay it inside the, the bed, you know. The, uh huh. The okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, it's official that the Trader Joe's community wants me to be in it. Y'all want, want me to be here, so I'm not going to fight it. I'm going to be here. The fact that I got so much love, <laughs> y'all, everybody was looking at me with my camera. <laughs> and for him to be like, oh, you vlogging? Let me get in there. So clearly, the girls, the community, the workers, the employees... <laughs> Want me to come to Trader Joe's? I'm now a Trader Joe's club member. So I got the eucalyptus, y'all, and it smells so good already. Like the ones I was ordering online did not smell this good, like this instantly. It smells so good. So actually, why am I lying? The ones I ordered online, girl, I could never even smell them at all. So this is already a step up. Do I wanna? I really, oh, that's so cute. Okay, I need to just tie it around this. My battery literally just now died, but I'll make this really, really quick. This is what it looks like, and it's so cute. I'm obsessed. Look how cute it looks. 
Child, I don't know if it's just me. Excuse the stains on the shirt. But this waist looking a little small. Okay. The waist. I could see that 1.5 off that waist. So it's a little bit later on in the evening. And I just now finished cooking. And I really think I'm going to do a self-care night tonight. And I'm so excited. I've been trying to do me a self-care night for so long. And I'm finally able to do it. I was like, you know what? Today we're going to do it. I'm not going to make no excuses. So I'm about to run my bath water. And I wanted to make a YouTube video for this. But I'm thinking I may just redo this routine tomorrow. And have like two self-care nights. Because I want to record a YouTube. But I also want to record a TikTok. And I literally cannot do both in one day. And I also, just tonight... I don't feel like doing a whole YouTube setup and everything, so I'm gonna just relax tonight. So let's get into this self care night, girl. about to clean up my kitchen because y'all are not gonna believe I did cook yesterday okay but after I took that bath y'all I was oh my god my camera is so dirty I am so sorry oh my gosh y'all ain't gonna believe after I took that bath I went in bed and I did not get out of bed at all I didn't even eat last night I didn't eat the food that I cooked so I didn't even clean up the kitchen either Nick put up all the food thankfully because I ain't do that either so my kitchen, oh, it looks so bad, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all. Ah, ah. Okay, that's all you get. Oh my gosh, I'm embarrassed. Don't try to pause the video either, but I'm gonna clean up because it needs to be done. And I ordered some food to be delivered for breakfast because I just was not in the mood for cooking. How are you? I feel like I'm doing really good with my own brand deals and managing everything by myself. But also, I feel like having a team to advocate. Having um, I'll make sure the one on one meetings, the monthly team meetings, the quarterly brand strategy meetings. Okay. So, y'all yeah, just had a meeting with a management company. This is, you guys know how I opened up to y'all and told y'all, well, not open up like it's girl, something serious, but well, it is serious, but um, I have been looking for management and I really want to have management very, very soon. Well, I feel like I should have already had it, but everything happens at the right time. And I'm really just looking for the right management company that I feel like will work the most for me and fit the most of my brand. And, you know, so that's what I just now finished doing and it went pretty well. So we'll see how everything goes, but it is most definitely a search to try to find the right management for any influencer you know so but y'all i wanted to show you guys please look at oh my gosh you guys know how if you don't know one thing about me is i'm a sweaty girl okay and it's so embarrassing to admit that but i am a sweaty girl whenever i'm in an environment where i'm nervous or i don't know like I just sweat and my un it's mainly my underarms y'all are y'all ready for this this is just from this first meeting this this one meeting okay and this is what I've been trying to tell y'all I really do feel like I have anxiety and this is proof of it <sighs> <Ooh. laughs> 
This is so embarrassing. Like my body literally embarrasses me. And you guys, have you guys ever heard of you can get Botox injections in your underarms to stop yourself from sweating? That is what I want. I don't care what anyone says. You do not understand the pain or the embarrassment that someone goes through with a sweaty underarm unless you've experienced it, unless you have it. If you don't have it, you won't be able to relate. But this is the most embarrassing thing ever, okay? I want the Botox injections. Jackie Aina got them and she said that they worked amazingly because she was also a sweaty girl. I saw Kyra I'm Unique on TikTok. She just got them. Like, it's important. Like, y'all, I sweat non-stop under my underarms. Like, that's the first place that sweats. And it's not just like a little, it's not just like a little bit of sweat. It's full on. And I don't know what, I was not always like this. And I don't know what it's caused, like what's causing it. But I can't continue on with life this way. Like, I can't. It's torture. This is torture, okay? So I'm going to be looking to see where I can possibly get these injections because I'm so serious about them. Like, I want to get these injections. And it is a form of Botox, but I don't care. Like, Botox has a bad rep, I feel like, especially in, like, the black community. But I don't care. Like, if you, want, if you don't like something and you want to get it fixed... Please do it because it's your body and that's exactly how I feel. Like, I'm not going to keep walking around with sweaty underarms if there's a way I can fix it. Why would I? Like, please. I look so dirty. It's embarrassing, y'all. It's embarrassing. Y'all, I'm watching Instagram Live and look what came in the mail. I got a Sephora Squad package. I love them so much, y'all. Look and look what they sent. A dog on bubble bath. I'm like, girl, not open this package. I cannot believe my eyes. I said, and then the candle. I said, oh, so y'all really love me. And then they also sent the new Olaplex product, but I already, I literally just now purchased that one. So I'm gonna go return this one. Thank you, Sephora. <laughs> So I'm currently filming, it's like 10 a.m. I'm currently filming the Amazon try on haul for YouTube and I keep on saying YouTube, girl, for Instagram and TikTok. <laughs> and I just did my makeup and I actually feel like it looks pretty cute. I think I like it. My lips keep on making that little line right there, but I think everything else came out pretty good. I just put my hair into a bun in the back because it's literally not cooperating, girl. My hair is not trying to do what I needed to do. It said, I don't know why you wasted your time trying to flat iron me. Put me in the ponytail. So that's exactly what I did. I need to get some braids real soon, but I'm gonna film this uh video. Then I have a, to go to the gym at 12. So I'm kind of like on a time crunch. But yeah, I'm really excited about this um, Amazon video. I want to start doing more try-on reels and TikToks on my channels. So we're going to see how this one turned out. Two hours later. Yo, I'm trying to learn this. I like dance. <laughs> okay. I'm going to learn it. Stop now. Pow. What? Wait. Oh. I can't get with these dances. Okay. Don't stop now. Hit, hit, pow. Hey, down. Pow, pow, pow. Hey. Okay. Click, click. What? Hey, hey, click, down, round, pow. Girl. Hey, click, down, round, pow. What? 
Stop now. 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 Okay. Pow. Mm -hmm. hey. So I'm finna go to the gym, y'all. It's getting close to my time, and I don't want to take my makeup off. I feel like it looks too cute, so I'm like, I'm gonna go to the gym with makeup on. <laughs> this is gonna be a little challenge. We gonna see if the girls could really do a workout with a full face of makeup. I feel like I can, but I know I'm gonna be sweating, so that's gonna get in the way. But girl, I got on lashes, everything. I'm gonna take the lips off for sure, probably. But we gonna see. <laughs> this is gonna be a little challenge to see how we look when we come back from the gym. Well, how I look when I come back from the gym with a full face. Can I do it? Can I come back looking cute? Stay tuned. about that so i'm back from the gym and y'all your girl look 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 the results are coming through like, let me show y'all real quick i told y'all i lost an inch i lost an inch and a half right off my waist but baby can we please get into the booty can we just get into her for a quick second okay i mean I'm so motivated at this point. Like, I also wanted to show y'all. I got a package from this other black owned brand. It's skincare that I'm gonna be trying out. Just look at how cute this skincare is, y'all. Look at how cute this is. It's called, it's by Skin Silk. And look at the little specks all in the, y'all see the specks in the product? In this product for sure. I believe it's like a um, gold, yeah, gold elixir. And then also the niacinamide cream. Now this has niacinamide in it, which is what the Glow Recipe Dew Drops have in it. That's like very, very hydrating. So I'm excited to see how these work. And then I also got Caudalie, girl, Caudalie, Caudalie. I hope that's how you pronounce it. This brand, they keep me on their PR list and they are always sending me multiples, like sending me a whole lot of stuff. And I got their Vinyl Perfect Serum. It's this Sam right here. And they sent me two of them, y'all. So one will most likely be going in the giveaway. And they also, what I'm most excited about, they sent your girl a gua sha. Ooh, ooh. We're gonna be lifting the skin, y'all. And I tell y'all, I get so many PR packages. And this is one of the things I was waiting on. I was like, somebody gonna send me a gua sha. I'm not even gonna buy it. Somebody gonna send me a gua sha. And look what came in the mail. Ooh, chiseled cheekbones, okay? Look at how good my makeup still looks. Like, wow. <laughs> my trainer could not believe that it like stayed. But I'm really feeling, feeling pretty good about life right now. And the work, y'all, is the work is the work is coming in, okay? And it's coming in very consistently. Like everything is giving consistent. I also want to thank you guys. On a serious note, I've been wanting to do this as well. I've been wanting to thank you guys so much for supporting my content. Like, you guys know I switched over. Well, I'm I'm making a switch to more so lifestyle content. And I am just so grateful to have you guys on my side as my supporters because y'all have been coming through with the support on my lifestyle content. And I am just so thankful, so grateful for you guys for that. And I just want y'all to know like it's going to continue. Um, I feel like you guys are also liking to see more of my life, more of me, more, more of my personality, you know, more of me being mobile, moving around. And I'm just also loving sharing that with you guys as well. And um, thank you. Thank you so much. Like, it does not go unnoticed. 
I notice every single bit of support that I get. I am doing the giveaways on Instagram right now. I'm going to also be including YouTube on that as well. But I just feel like right now I'm going to focus on Instagram. But still, of course, interact with my content because I'm always seeing like on YouTube, still interact with my YouTube content because I always take note of who's constantly commenting on my YouTube videos. And trust me, all of that will be worth it whenever I start doing the YouTube giveaways as well. So just keep on supporting your good sis on all the platforms. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much. Like y'all really appreciate it. So I'm back from running my errands and everything. And y'all look at this big old package that I had to go pick up from the shipping center. Like they couldn't even deliver it because it's literally so big. Like, do y'all see my hand? Like, look, what is this? I don't even know what it is. So we finna open this up and see what's in here. How? How am I supposed to get this out of here? Girl, this is the biggest thing I've ever got. Oh my gosh. Let's see what's in the inside. Oh my gosh. So the top tier has a robe, a waffle robe, but I was just now looking up to purchase one. Two towels and then a whole lot of their products. Thank you so much. And then y'all, let's get into down here. Are you kidding me right now? A whole skincare fridge. Wow. I have wanted one of these for so long. And it's also a vanity right here. Wow, a rose gold colored vanity. Okay, hold on. A forever mood candle? Hold on, baby. Oh my God. And a forever mood candle? Let me try to smell. Oh, yes. Mm. It's me already having set up the skincare fridge, girl. I was not wasting no time, y'all. Look at how bomb and cute this is. I decided to put it in the guest bathroom because it will not fit in the other bathroom, our main one. There's already so much stuff on that counter, girl. But look at this light. Come on. It's giving vanity. It's giving vanity. It's giving sit here and do your skincare, do your makeup, okay? And then, oh, it also has three different levels. Cool. Oh, no, that's really cool. Warm, mid, wow. And then to open the fridge. Oh, look how bomb. I've already put products in here. Like, was I awaiting this package? <laughs> look, and it's getting cool as well. And I have all my masks in this drawer. And I also put my stickers on here as well that came with the package. I decided to put them on the refrigerator instead of the mirror. So yeah, it's like self-love affirmation stickers, skincare type stickers. So all right, patches on, shower taken, glass of water poured, waffle robe put on. It's looking like a inside Friday night to me, and I'm not mad at it whatsoever. I'm looking forward to it, and I'm going to see y'all in the morning.